Welcome again to a new Radiology Bits video. Our case today is a basic case. We're going to provide you with the image and, as usual, try to pause to think about the findings and your differential diagnosis. This is a scout image of a 67-year-old female patient. Pause here. Now to the discussion. The abnormality is obvious. There is an abnormal density that is located in the right upper abdominal quadrant. The density of this lesion is actually equal to that of bones suggesting calcifications. What are the possibilities? Looking at this abnormality, you'll notice that it simulates an appearance of an eggshell. And this is what we call in radiology eggshell calcifications. Eggshell calcifications has been classically described with calcified lymph nodes. Now calcified lymph nodes may have various appearances. Eggshell calcification is not the commonest, but it has a peculiar differential diagnosis. It may be due to an infection such as tuberculosis, histoplasmosis, or other fungal infections. It could be a result of occupational lung disease such as silicosis could be a granulomatous condition such as sarcoidosis and it could be seen in treated lymphoma. A very rare cause of eggshell calcification would be amyloid deposition. The location of the abnormality, the large size and the absence of other similar lesions would argue against the lymph node. So what could this be? Eggshell calcifications other than lymph nodes may be due to calcification of the shell of a cystic abnormality or wall calcifications within a vascular abnormality such as an aneurysm. Here's the CT on the same patient showing that the abnormality is hepatic in location. It has a rim of eggshell calcification and an internal low density that is consistent with fluid which is confirmed by looking at the post-intravenous contrast acquisition that shows no internal soft tissue components. So this basically rules out the possibility of an aneurysm which is a dangerous diagnosis that we should not miss. Although hepatic cysts from various reasons are common, one of the common cystic abnormalities that show calcifications is that of a hydatid cyst. The take-home point from this case is of course to know the differential diagnosis for eggshell calcifications, but it's very important to remember that eggshell calcifications may mean a vascular aneurysm. Thank you for watching. Please share the video, subscribe, like, and join our Twitter account. See you later.